This is my story, told for the first time. It started off small. I didn't notice what was going on. For a while, I ignored the looks and laughter that happened behind my back. I thought we had something. I thought we were friends. I told her secrets, confident she was going to keep them, not hold them against me. Before, I would have done anything she asked, because I thought she'd do the same. After a while, things got worse. There were the messages, emails, and texts. And not long after that, things were posted all over social media. There were guys all of a sudden. They would push me around, and sometimes it got really rough. When I thought things couldn't get worse, there were threats. I needed help, but no one seemed to listen. I was scared and didn't want to go back to school. One day, I looked up and saw the poster. I took the poster when I saw a girl in the same state as me. I had hoped to reach out to her. It took a while, but I finally decided that I needed to get things off my chest now with this. While writing this, I have learned that the bully isn't the only one who can take pride in taking over someone's life. I can take pride in taking mine back. Speak up to break the silence on bullying and depression. Type this 250 word or less essay on how bullying affects you and those around you. Turn it into the counseling office by September 30th. By entering, you are eligible to get a prize and be able to get your story out.